Welcome back. We have reached everybody's favorite bounty tank and are on our way to Beak 15. Which I think is less involved than the drive on Pharaohs is. This looks pretty nice. The snow. I mean, we've seen similar stuff on uh, other planets already, I guess. I definitely remember there being uh, stuff to pick up along the side of the road here. Couldn't really find any on um, Thurum. So we'll see if they actually removed stuff, or if I just missed it, or misremembered that it was there. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, okay, there is. So either I missed stuff on Ferrum, or I just um, forgot that there was nothing there. Katana six shotgun. Oh god, got a lot of stuff actually. Medical Interface 5! That I'll take. Because these are nice, because the medical interfaces are better than just the first aid interface, because you get the health regeneration, but also toxin resistance. Which also means I can now give Liara my old first aid interface, so she can restore health as well. And we got a better shotgun. For Tali. Too bad there's no Chick Tick of Us Pulse in this game. I really like the the drones and Oh. Maybe you should take care of him first. Probably more important. Ow. I'm just kind of letting myself get hit here. I cannot see where the rest is. Probably further into the tunnel. Can I shoot them over there from here? Probably not. Oh, there is stuff here. Can't you get out on the other side? It's much easier. Medium armor. Nothing else of interest. Can I get back into Mako, please? I think I mentioned it earlier, but it is actually pretty easy to just run past all of this. If you're not interested in the XP, if you just gun it for the end, you'll probably make it. You might be on fire by the time you get there, but it's not that bad. Pretty sure I started doing that in my Insanity run when uh, I reached level 60. I didn't need the XP anymore, so I just barreled past everything in the Mako. The glass definitely looks better here. And I was m managed to do it even on insanity, so. Uh oh, we got a Colossus, I guess. Could you pack that into a crate? No, this is just an armature. They're really not worth that much uh, drama to introduce. Are you a Colossus or are you a. I'm sure. We'll see about how quickly he dies, I guess. He was definitely an armature. There's another guy there, but we really see him from here.
There you go. I guess you always get out on the left side of the Mako. Sniper rifle, is that something I want? Does have higher DPS. So sure, why not? I think there is something here in, on Peak 15 that you need hard electronics for. Which is why it's good that I have Tali with me. No real need for that elsewhere so far. It's all been easy and average. Where is that? Not on this side, I don't think. No! I did not intend to do that. I want to run off the edge. That would be bad. Let's quick save. I don't want to jump off the edge either. If at all possible. I cannot see where they are. You're... You ragdolled that far? That's impressively bad. Is that a Colossus? They do show up on the map like that. No, it's just a turret. He can't even hit us from there. Metagel. Why would I need that while in the Mako? There's peak 15, I guess. That looks pretty nice. I'm so paranoid of just blasting myself off the edge here doing that. Probably is also a good squat mate to have with me for it. There we go. For the Gef. Maybe for the... Rachni, not so much. I mean, Tali in general is a good squat mate to have with you, unless you yourself are heavily tech. There you are. So as an engineer, there's not that much reason to uh, to have Tali with you. I would say as an adept, I don't have that much reason to, reason to have Liara with me, except I've already pointed out numerous times how ridiculously overpowered biotics are, so you can never have too much of that in this game. There's a turret. At this point I don't... Yeah. Let's try to mount that rock. Um, at this point I don't even really care. Alright, we've made it. Now we got the creepy music. Everybody using the right weapons. 
I just like to make sure of that. Gef Juggernaut. Is that hackable? Let's try it. The answer appears to be no. So that was a waste. Guess we need more... They're called a repair drone. Do you actually repair stuff? It doesn't really look like it. And level up. And you're a Krogan. Um. Oh, that's right. This place is filled with stuff that... That you, uh... Pick up with biotics, which always makes for very chaotic battles. Right, um, I guess there's another one. But that's not an issue, because we can lift him too. Or we could if it had worked. User alert. All Peak 15 facilities have suffered a great deal of damage. Biohazard materials present throughout facility. Virtual intelligence user interface offline. We'll need to get the reactors back online. I guess we do. At least this is not the part where Mira likes to shout that into your ear every 10 seconds. I can't get up there. I'm, I know there's stuff to find in here. Anything back here? I guess not. Must only be upstairs then. I was stuck. Light armor. And a sniper rifle. Not worth it, though. Neither is that armor. This is when you... One of you is still stuck. Liara, are you outside? Are you stuck behind the door? Well, I'm sure you'll uh, join me at some point. Why are the turrets facing the wrong way? They want to keep their people in as much as they want to keep others out. Or maybe they want to keep the Rachni in. Can't shoot the turrets. I guess the smoke is meant to indicate recent usage of said turrets. Ferrum isn't too bad in the amount of crap you get, but... Noveria and Pharaohs are both pretty terrible. You ha if you didn't clean out your inventory before you went, you are going to run into trouble. Oh wait, I leveled up, didn't I? Yes, I did. Oh, I do still got four points, so I guess it is level 20 when that stops. Well, I'm not going to complain about that. Um, let's do... Throw... I'm not really using barriers, so... Nemesis and Spectre Training. Liara... Um, lift and Singularity. And Tali, I'll put the points in Damping, because that does... 
improve her other abilities as well. I don't really need to put points in first aid for her because we have Liara with us. And we're barely using Metagel anyway. Um, Shredder rounds are good against organics. Aren't they? Yeah. So, against the um, Rachni we'll be facing, that might be a good option. What am I using? Incendiary. Oh, we have better ones of those, actually. So we'll go up to that. Do incendiary affect your cooldown? I forget if they do. No, they just decrease your accuracy. Well, that's not really a problem. And Liara's using... Also using Shredder Rounds. No, wait, that's what I just... No, yeah. That's fine. I think we're mostly done with Geth for now. Why are you putting your gun away? Seems like a terrible idea. Um, actually, I know there's going to be Geth. No, we are not done with Geth. Fine, I'll switch it back. We don't have any, uh... We don't have any, uh... Synthetic damage rounds, do we? Those are tungsten rounds. Oh, we do have those. Fine, I'll take that. Anything better here? What do I have? I have a Combat Scanner 5 and Real Extension 5. That's fine. There. Oh. Hi. See, now he goes and fights his friends. Which is always fun. Um, I might want to get out of the way of that. When you're playing as an adept, a really important skill to have in this game is uh, skeet shooting. Um, Oh, he's the hack trooper. Oh well, he's dead now. He wasn't much used to us anymore from over there. There's more dudes somewhere. Hi, I don't think you've noticed me. Now he has. Doesn't matter. Just a regular trooper I don't care much about. Alright, now we're gonna be facing Ragni. What was that? Animals? Wind? This place is in bad shape. I guess you could say animals. Um, then I just give Tali a real extension. And now we have a six. Alright, now you can use... Um, Shredder rounds. Keep Liara.
Toxic damage is nice. Let's give her that. Uh... Oh. These are just small guys. I forgot about those. I don't think this is going to accomplish anything against them, but, uh... Give it a try, I guess. I've never seen anything like them. Xenobiology is not my field. Maybe someone in the labs knows. Maybe they do. And there's another one. And they just love to pop out of uh, vents and grates and stuff here. If I remember correctly. You can hear them moving around. Hurricane 6, Storm 6 shotguns. Nope. Uh, Providic weapons research? <laughs> sure. I seem to remember... I really thought they showed up in this room. I guess I was wrong. Oh. Or they just show up really late. It's also an option. What the hell? Molly, why did you switch to your assault rifle? Are you overheating? Is that it? Because the real extension does do that. It decreases heat absorption. Let's see if it happens again. If so, then I'll switch her to something else. Moving on. Yara's also using her assault rifle. Why? Also, Liara, why is your health so low? Did you get hit by that one that one Ragnar? System, Shepherd. Must be for the station mainframe. The damage is not extensive. It could be repaired. Critical startup error. Virtual intelligence user interface offline. Manual boot required. All right, we have to do this the hard way. That's not something that's useful to me. Oh yeah, we have to do this first. The world's easiest puzzle. And Bioware's favorite puzzle. Towers of Annoy. I think I said so before. It, this one's particularly easy because it does not matter um, if you move it to Core 2 or 3. At least if you... Um, 
if you had to get it to core 3, then at least you'd have to think about how to get started. But it doesn't. The presentation here is a little bit weird because you, if you move an, an item, it shows up where it was and not um, at the bottom, which is if you were doing this with a traditional setup with disks and uh, pegs, it would do. I mean, Towers of Noise is pretty simple. You basically, you cannot put bigger things on top of smaller things, so you always have to move the big thing to a new place first, then you can put the small one on top of that. So now you've freed up the third one. So I'm gonna end up with them in core 2 now. Um, I think. So I can move that. Now, in order to get this one where I want it, I need to move that out of the way first, and you can go on that because it's smaller. So then I can move that there, and that there. Then I can move the bottom piece to core 2. And now, you want to make sure that you uh, can get this piece here, which means that we need to get this piece there out of the way. Which means that we need to move this one here first. Put that one there so we can move that one. That allows us to put this piece over there. Then get that one out of the way so we can move that piece there. And then we are done. It looks like you're trying to restore this facility. Would you like help? Crap, a pop-up. It's Clippy. That joke was still relevant when this game was made. 2007, um, I think is the first version of Office, Office 2007, that didn't have Clippy anymore. 2003, I think Clippy was de-emphasized, but it was still there if you wanted, wanted it. You're the virtual intelligence that runs this place? This system is monitored to respond to the name Mira. May I ask your name? Commander Shepard, I work for the Citadel Special Tactics and Reconnaissance. One moment, please. Council authority confirmed. You are entitled to secure access of all systems. Please note that queries relating to corporate secrets require privileged access. Privileged access is only available to binary helix executives. This system is ready to process queries. You may access me at any holographic interface within Peak 15. I need to find Matriarch Benezia. Lady Benezia departed on the passenger tramway to the Rift Station subsidiary labs. User alert. The tramway system is currently inoperable. What's the situation here? One moment, please. Diagnostics in progress. Critical failure. Main reactor shutdown in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. Critical failure. Landline connections are disabled. Passenger tram systems are offline. Report complete. Do you have an additional system status query? Do you know why the reactor was shut down? I'm sorry, but I was offline at the time. Shutdown could occur if reactor breach seems likely, or in the case of catastrophic laboratory containment failure. Emergency guidelines suggest the frigid environment will kill biological contagions. It may also damage mechanical ones. Turn off the heat and hope the cold puts whatever you've unleashed to sleep. Nice. Well, it's better security protocols than Umbrella would have. What do I need to do to get the power back on? The valves to the helium-3 fuel line must be opened. This can be done at the controls on the reactor assembly proper. What are the landlines and why are they disabled? The landlines connect my mainframes here at Central Station to the various sub-facilities of Peak 15. This allows the crew to remotely access my databases from the comfort and security of their labs. When emergency protocols were implemented within the hot labs, the cabling was automatically ejected. How do I reconnect the landlines? The landlines are designed for easy reconnection. The router for the landlines is on the roof of operations. Simply activate the controls and the hardware will reconnect and reboot automatically. Tell me what happened here. I'm sorry, but I need a more specific query. 
Tell me what occurred immediately before you shut down. Stage one alert issued at Hot Labs. Contaminants released from Laboratory Pod Gamma. Emergency protocols implemented. Stage two alert issued at Hot Labs. Isolation two breached. Tram shut down. Landline to Hot Labs disconnected. Stage three alert issued locally. Contaminants in tram tunnels. Station shut down and evacuation initiated. Code Omega sent. What sort of contaminants escaped? I'm sorry, Commander. Inquiries related to our research require privileged access. Only executives of Binary Helix have that level of clearance. Yep, well, we know it's the Ragnai. The creatures we've encountered here, did they come from the labs? I'm sorry, Commander. Inquiries related to our research require privileged access. Only executives of Binary Helix have that level of clearance. You're such a big help. Why were you taken offline? In the event, Peak 15 must be sterilized for security purposes. My program and data are purged. They kill you if something goes wrong? My systems are permanently disabled. To be killed, I would need to be alive. I am merely a database program. <laughs> Shepard continues to assign more abilities to VIs than they actually possess. Uh, we have the damage report. That's all I need right now. Very well, Commander. Logging you out. User alert. Main oh, reactor God. shut down in accordance with emergency the annoying containment part. procedures. Manual restart required. User alert. Landline connections are disabled. Well, let's Passenger go fix this uh, are offline. quickly, I guess. Um, isn't there a door here? Yeah. There is. Oh wait, she doesn't repeat it over and over. Did they fix that for the legendary edition? That's worth the sixty bucks right there. Now exiting to the roof. User alert. Landline connections are disabled. Passenger trams are offline. User alert. Main reactor oh, shut no, she down does in it. accordance with emergency containment procedures. Maybe less often. Manual restart required. All right, User alert. Ragnar Landline here. connections are. Um, Tali, you're not doing well, are you? Yeah, Tolly's dead. Can we please? Oh, that one was already dead. Okay, Rack Knight are still a pain to deal with if they just rush you, and everybody's dead. User alert. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual All right, restart required. You're done required. taking a nap. User alert. Landline connections are disabled. Passenger trams are offline. Let's restore their health a little bit quick, more quickly. Maybe I should put some points in first aid for somebody because we didn't, couldn't even restore Tali's health fully. Fortunately, she does have a uh, first aid interface. So that problem will solve itself. Tali really needs better armor to um, withstand the poison that the Ragnar use, or at the very least, she needs to stay in cover. So that's going to be interesting here. User alert! Main reactor shut. Connections restored. 
processing new data. User alert, unable to connect to hot lab facilities. Tell me what happened here. I'm sorry, but I need a more specific query. Can I do this? What's the status of Rift Station? Rift Station has been locked down by the staff. There are presently no contaminants within the facility. The staff is alive then? Yes, though the number of personnel is below the official staff count. Why is Rift Station locked down? Emergency procedures require each facility to isolate itself to prevent the spread of contagion. It would also appear that there are several employees quarantined for medical treatment. If it's locked down, will I be able to enter? The passenger trams can bring you to the facility. Further access will be at the discretion of the security forces there. Give me a status report on the hot labs. I am sorry. The network connections to the labs have been damaged. Data is limited. Um, that we did all of that. That's all I need right now. Very well, Commander. Logging guess you, you out. Guess you could get more data with the uh, landlines reconnected, which makes sense. All right, let's go to the reactor. Pretty sure User we're going to alert. Face Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual sure. restart required. Pretty sure we face Gef there. Um, which means I should probably change to synthetic stuff, but uh, wait, I still have an option to enter the core. What's that good for? Online. Oh. Connected to subsidiary facilities. How may I assist you? That's all I need right now. Very well, Commander. Logging you out. Wasn't there on alert. the side here? Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. I knew it. That's why I didn't want to switch uh, weapons or ammo yet. Alright. Didn't mean to pick up the grates, but I guess I did. So obsessively quick saving up the elevator. Reactor. User alert. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. Okay, now I think I want to change alert. my uh, uh, incendiary is fine. Toxic is fine. It's just Tali that's using shredder rounds. Let's give her a proton. No, we do have. We did have. Uh, Tungsten rounds. Let's give it those. Anything new here? No. Just making sure I didn't pick up stuff that I Main didn't notice. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual. Re I like how Restart pretty much re every single GAF encounter will require more combat scanner than than I than I have. Acquired. So why do I even bother equipping them? That was a grenade upgrade. I think is better than what I have, yes. Attack you. Let's not get shot by you. 
Um, destroyers are annoying. Especially when they rush you. Oh, there's another one. There is another one. Abort. Tali's probably not, gonna, not even going to hit with her shotgun, so that's why it's not useful. User alert. Main reactor shutdown in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. We still have a stalker there. You. I don't like you. But we got him. We're still jammed. I don't know if there's anybody on this side. There is. Alright, no longer jammed. There's somebody... Oh, now we are again. They're upstairs. Gonna go via the other way. User alert. Main reactor Wait. shut down in accordance with emergency oh, there containment you are. procedures. Manual restart required. Don't know if he's the only one here. Jumping around. There you are. All right. Now there are some guys left up here. Um, I don't think that's gonna work, guys. User alert. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. A juggernaut. Alright. That's why I didn't want to go out here, because he can hit you from here, I'm pretty sure. But we took care of that easily enough. <laughs> Nothing particularly great. Um, except shred around six for organics, which is good. One of those pistols better. Oh yeah, that's a good one. Did I level up again? No. I wasn't sure. What is Tali using shotgun wise? She already is using her katana six. All right, we actually need to go down to get to the reactor. I think we're done with the gaff here. That's User why. alert. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. Which is why I switched back to um, shredder rounds for Tali. All right, everything's fixed. We've completed the repair speed 15. Good. Then let's get out of here and go to the rift station. Online. 
Connected to subsidiary facilities. How may I assist you? Tell me what happened here. I'm sorry, but I need a more specific query. That's all I need right now. Very well, Commander. Right. Nothing new after doing that. Are there new Arachni here? Sometimes there are. Well, that looks kind of cool, the ice. Good job on that. Knew it. I just knew it. Like what? Why did you not get affected by singularity? That venom of theirs just does so much damage. I don't know if there's a an armor upgrade that does better on that. Now entering decontamination and transit hub. User alert. Loose contaminants in the decontamination chamber. Access to passenger tramways inadvisable. Yeah, there are some Rachni in there, and I think this is what you need hard electronics for. They are locked in. I could bypass the door. It looks like the trams to the subsidiary stations are beyond it. No, we're gonna do this instead. The tough one. Maybe here? I am not going to be able to do this. Can I do it again? Yes. Got it. Alright, that gave us a decent chunk of money and XP. Uh, let's see. Lift, Singularity, Nemesis, and Spectre Training. <laughs> Liara, we can do... Lift and Singularity again. Tolly. Let's do Advanced Damping. And Armor. Control group loose in the... They're in... Can't escape. Up the tunnels now. We're sorry. The leech couldn't get to the fatal struck. Without why you can. He killed himself because he was part of whatever happened here? He must have felt there was no hope of surviving. That killing himself would be easier. I guess so. Online. Connected to subsidiary facilities. How may I assist you? That's all I need right now. Very well, Commander. Logging you out. Nothing there. Of course, the junk bin is full of everything but junk. I mean, it is kind of junk, but... Uh, it's not what I would put into a junk bin. It's junk in the sense that it's not really useful to me. Oh. Of course. Oh, good job on that. I would not have expected that. Do it. Could not hit them. 
Oh, I got it. Little face huggers. Also reminds me of the horde in Halo. They have the stuck behind the door. Yeah, we'll catch up. All right, tram station. Which is active. Well, uh, Tali, Liara, you plan on coming with me or? Departing Central Station. Destination Rift Station. And it's basically an elevator, but horizontal. Now arriving at Rift Station. Binary Helix Research Facility. I guess your squat mates are useful against the Arachni, as long as they don't immediately get killed and, you know, manage to land a hit. Both of which are pretty tall orders. Um... That's the way we're out, isn't it? At the end. And there is the haunt lapse here, which right now we can't get to. I believe if you go there early, like there's a way here that you can basically screw everything up and have to fight uh, the people upstairs and then you can't do any of the side quests here. Forget exactly uh, what you do to accomplish that. I think it involves going to the hot laps early. But that's of course not what I want to do. Stand down. Sorry, we couldn't be sure what was on the tram. Can those things work at trains controls? Hell if I know. I'm not assuming any goddamn thing. Look, you're human and that's enough that I won't shoot, but I'd like to know who you are. My name's Shepard. I'm a Spectre. Huh. Uh, I won't look a heavily armed horse in the mouth. The aliens overran the hot labs last week. Only Han Olar got out and he ain't all there anymore. The first we knew the bastards were clawing into my command post. We had a lot more staff then. You were taken by surprise and had civilians to protect. You did a good job, Captain. Yeah? Sure as hell doesn't feel like it. The board sent an Asari to clean up the mess. She went to the hot labs yesterday. We haven't heard from her since. I'm not gonna let any of your people die. All I can do is hold out here and protect the civilians. There's an emergency elevator out by the trams. This card will let you activate it. it can take you down to the hot labs. Oh, and if you need any first aid, Dr. Cohen's downstairs in the med bay. You're certain the matriarch is still in the hot labs? She hasn't come back here. You came through Central Station, so she ain't there. Did the aliens come from inside the facility, or did they attack from the outside? You want my personal opinion? Labs like that exist to do stupid crap that gets people killed. Did the aliens come from inside oh, the facility? You want my personal opinion? Labs like that exist to do stupid crap that gets people killed. Tell me about the structure of the hot labs. It's built into one of the glaciers further down the mountain. Real old, thick stable. Something goes wrong, they heat it up and sink it into the ice. Normally, the crew gets to the labs using a tram from Central Station. We've got an elevator that connects directly, but it's for emergency use only. Uh, listen. I'm not sending my people down there. It's too dangerous. You understand? It's fine. We'll go. Tell me about Rift Station. I can't talk about everything. What do you need to know? Tell me about the defenses here. Secure enough that you shouldn't poke in corners. I was just impressed with your operation. Being able to weather a week of assaults is no mean feat. Only the best get assigned to high security facilities like this. What impresses me most is the turrets, alarms, and cameras. They're all routed through a central location out by the quarantine labs. One guy can lock down the whole facility. The security hub's the last logical fallback, and we'd have cover from the turrets all the way. What kind of research is done here? Beats me. I'm not supposed to know. So long as people don't start dying, it's not my problem. 
What can you tell me about the aliens? Ask Dr. Olar. He's the only one who made it out of the hot labs. He's the only Volus left in here. I need to know more about the situation in the hot labs. The facility's off the network. The only way to find out would be to send scouts down the elevator, and I won't send my people to their death. How are your people holding up? We weren't expecting the initial wave. They made it inside. We lost some good people. Those of us left are shorthanded. We've kept order by long shifts and stems. I don't like it, but I don't see an alternative. I've got work to do. Yeah, I hear that. Hell! Man the perimeter! All right, I knew that was going to happen. Um, is there more? Showing an enemy on the map. But he didn't actually come out of the vent. Great. Can we move on? I guess we can. Does it have bad consequences? Now it's gone. I think they're not going to be happy because we didn't yeah. help out. Thanks for your help back there. It looked like you could handle it. Thanks for the vote of conf. If you don't want to help us here, why don't you go? Yeah. No, I don't want to do that. It's not my fault. It was a glitch. Right, this time it worked correctly. I think using Singularity too early might have caused that. Thanks for the help. Every few hours a group comes up the tram tunnel. It's actually better since we locked down the elevator. I'll do whatever I can. I don't know why they keep drawing themselves against our defenses. Even animals should learn not to stick their noses where it hurts. I think it's because they're trying to get to their queen. Alright, that went better. Alright, well, there's quite a lot of stuff to do here, I think. I don't really remember the layout of this place, so... Where did they come from? Were they in the lab? I never went in the high security areas. No, there's a few people we could talk to. What? You're a member of the science teams. Recently transferred, yes. What do you do here? Molecular genetics. I specialize in biotic-enhanced allele-specific hybridization. Yeah, that's a bit technical for me. I am very good at tracking inherited variations in genetic sequences. I'm sure you would find it quite dull. That is indeed what, what you said then, so... You seem less upset about this situation than the others. That is one of the virtues of the meditation you interrupted. Maybe you should meditate in private rather than just by standing at the edge of a room. Tell me about yourself. I am Alestia Alice from the University of Arraeus. Is there anything in particular you want to know, or should I just spout random facts? Uh, random facts seem to work for most people we meet. Did I interrupt something? <sighs> I was meditating. I suppose to a species as brash as yours, it would appear to be inattention. Do you know Matriarch Benezia? Why ask me, and not your friend? Because I do not know anything about the Matriarch. Your then daughter. Why would I? That's all for now. Then I will return to my meditations. 
and we're asking you because she's here and you might have seen her. So, rude much? Uncertain. I welcome you. Cautiously, I am curious to know what you're doing here. I heard there were some problems up here. Furtively, I am concerned about the state of our guards. Many have been awake for days. For now, with forced cheer, I still have a limited supply of equipment to sell. Let's have a look. Regretfully, most of my stock is being appropriated by Captain Ventralis. Ah, it looks like you have some uh, good stuff here, though. Phoenix 6 Light Armor is not better than what we have. Unity 5 Amp is uh, it's not really worth it. Chameleon Tool 4 is what Tali already has, and for Liara I don't really care right now. So I guess Metagel Upgrade is all we can get. Well, I'll take that. What? No! <sighs> Sorry. I haven't had much sleep since the attack. Is there something you need? I'm looking for an Asari. Asari? Well, there's Dr. Ayalis over there. There's also our guest, Lady Benezia. Captain Ventralis might know where she is. Yeah, he already told us, so I don't really know why we're asking this. What sort of work do you do here? I can't say. I signed a non-disclosure agreement. If we survive, I'd like to keep my job. The location is terrible, but the pay is better than any other commercial lab. You're not happy on Peak 15? The outside world doesn't exist here. Just walls of ice and rock. There's only the work, the discovery. It's easy to forget why science is guided by ethics. Maybe we're paying for that now. I'd say so. What do you know about the hot labs? Nothing. I didn't work there. As far as I know, Han Olar was the only survivor. Is he in the medical ward? No, he's staying in the science team's quarters. Be gentle with him. He had a trying experience. What do you do here? I'm a toxicologist. I can't talk about my work. Not that I'm doing anything since the accident. There was an accident here? I can't talk about what happened. Not here. Too public. Talk to Dr. Cohen in the medical ward. He was the project lead. How are you holding up? It would be petty to complain after showering off a co-worker's brain. None of us have had enough sleep since the attack. Of course, not all of us have guns. I'll talk to you later. Remember to report any suspicious noises. Um, okay. Sure, I will. Um, restricted area, I don't want to go there yet, I don't think. Let's go to the medical bay first. I don't really remember what a good order is to do things in here. Hang on. What, what, what do you want? I didn't mean to bother you. No, you did nothing wrong. I'm just distracted. Another voice roll by uh, Dwight Schultz. What happened to these people? They're suffering from a toxin. There was an accident. I have a non-disclosure agreement. I shouldn't discuss it with anyone outside of the company. But you're going to, because I might be able to help. And I'd like to think that the company finds our lives more valuable than their secrets. Probably not. You know Mira, the VI for Peak 15? She handles the safety protocols for our experiments here. We reactivated her on our way through Central Station. That was you? I'm grateful. Until she came online, the automatic equipment wouldn't work. We lost the connection to Mira in the middle of an experiment and the quarantine failed. These three were exposed to a toxin, something we were working on. I understand your caution, but I need details. What you say won't go beyond these walls. It's a bioweapon. Based on an exotic life form discovered on the frontier. They wanted something that could kill the creature. But there was no profit in something that kills one species on the frontier. We kept working on it and adapted it to affect more species. Thoros B is highly infectious, but can't pass from one person to another, like a bio-war attack without a pandemic spread. Do you imagine that distinction makes this ethical? 
militaries, governments. They'll get this kind of weapon one way or another, and we're trying to limit the damage. I know you can't see that. There's a reason the Citadel Conventions forbid bioweapons, Doctor. I didn't expect you'd understand. Our notes and equipment are locked in the quarantine labs. Captain Ventralis doesn't want to risk more contamination. Is he right to keep people out? No, the toxin has a brief period of viability. After that, it breaks down into simple protein chains. But he won't listen to me. I'll talk to him. Maybe I can convince him to let me try. I can't ask you to do this officially, but if you can do anything, I'd appreciate it. What will it take to get the cure for these people? The quarantine labs are... Once you're in there, look for our notes. It should just be a matter of following our processes. How's the science team holding up? Better than Ventralis' guards. They've been on alert since the first attack. I've been administering stims at their request. But every species needs to sleep. They're getting twitchy, irrational. Are you the doctor here? I'm a doctor, but not the doctor. My specialty is microbiology, not first aid. We had a medic, Dr. Sala, but he's... We lost him. The automatics can handle basic treatment. Mira runs them. Talk to you later. I hope you can do something. All right, we got our uh, assignment. First, first assignment here. My thoughts exactly. This system is online and ready to provide emergency services. What are you doing over here? I administrate the systems of all of the various Peak 15 facilities. What treatments have been attempted? I'm afraid treatment is not possible. An unknown toxin is present within the tissues of each patient. What's wrong with these people? Accessing logs. They were in the midst of an experiment when the shutdown began. When you were taken offline. Without my program to administrate containment procedures, a quarantine breach occurred. Okay. Those seem really bad failsafes. Think you could run that equipment for us? Certainly, Commander. One moment, please. Okay. Not really sure what that achieved, but this whatever. This system is online and ready to provide emergency What's wrong with these people? Without my program to administrate containment procedures. Okay. We don't need anything Very right well, now. Commander. Nothing new. Um. Alright. Let's head uh, to the... Actually, let's head to Quarantine and barracks. What's this then? Oh, this does not go downstairs. I thought this was the way downstairs. We'll just steal some other weapons. I'm sure they won't need him in the middle of a Rachni attack. RPG logic. Hurricane 7 shotgun. Not worth it, even though it gets an extra slot. Alright, let's talk to Captain Ventrales again. Like, yeah, yeah, so if you do go to the hot labs first, I think, and then... Or to the... Whatever the, the, the basement with the Russian guy is, anyway. Is that the hot laps or is the hot laps where Benezia is? Don't remember. Um, if you go there first, then yeah, these people will turn against you, I think. And you can't do any of this or even buy stuff. Something you need? I've heard about the problems in the quarantine lab. I'd like to recover the toxin cure. God, I wish we could help those guys. I really do, but we can't risk contamination now. We're not part of your defense plans. We're consuming extra rations, extra metagel. Yeah, but you also have extra guns. All right, you want to gamble with your life, you're not under my command. I'll have the guard let you in, but he'll lock the door behind you. He'll run a full scan before he'll let you out. If there are any anomalies, you stay in there. Those are reasonable precautions. I'll radio ahead to let the guard know. Good luck. 
I've got work to do. You and me both. Oh, wait, that's the wrong way. Uh, I think the whole not being able to kill everybody here, be, uh, like the, the second Arachni getting stuck, is something that happened to me before. That felt familiar. Having to redo that part to make sure he isn't angry at you. I don't know if you're if he lets you into the quarantine labs or anything like that if he is angry at you. Didn't mean to draw my gun. Pointless long hallway. Could have just had the elevator right there. Alright, um, Han Olar is here. You came to find out about them, didn't you? You mean those things out there? Yes. I'm the only survivor from the hot lab, you know. I need to know more about those things out there. About the Rachni? Rachni? That's preposterous. Where did they come from? They found it in a derelict ship. An egg. Waiting since the last battles. They brought it here. Shut up! God, you want to get us killed? I don't have any control over who lives or dies here. Do you? If you're gonna be crazy, be the quiet kind. Crazy? I'm sane. God, am I sane. I need to know everything about the Rachni. I told you all I can. We brought the Rachni back from the dead. In retrospect, a bad decision. I heard you were at the hot labs. How did you make it out alive? I killed her. Who? Doctors on Mua. We were going to lunch when the alarms went off. I ran into the tram. And I closed the doors. She banged on the window once, then they sliced her to pieces. Her head came apart like a melon. I closed the door. I killed her. Tell me what you know. I'll make your survival mean something. You think I want absolution? There is none. Could Matriarch Benezia survive in the hot labs? It's possible. The specimens were sensitive to biotics. As we know. I'll be leaving now. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing too interesting. They used to have nightmares like this. Okay, can't talk to them. In particular detail, um... You're not part of the crew. I have Ventralis' permission to go in there. Yeah, he radioed. He also said you have to prove you're not contaminated to get out. You got a death wish? You should stand watches on the barricade. Uh, we kinda did. There's an ambush in here, isn't there? And one of these rooms contains something. Just metagel. Not useful. That could be more useful. Not fast enough. There we go. Well, I guess it's all free money, even if I can't use it directly. Quarry and armor? Please tell me it's 
not terrible. Uh, it's not terrible. It's not the greatest ever, and it's a hilarious color scheme, but um, hey, I'll take it. Don't get that. Uh, I want another medical thing. But I don't have any. Alright, definitely want to save after that. Don't want to lose that if I happen to die from this ambush. Okay. Alright. Your mission ends here, Shepard. I thought she seemed odd. What happened to Ventralis's man? I didn't have permission to come in. He got in my way. I was ordered to eliminate you should the opportunity arise. And here you are, trapped in this lab. Weapons free! Um... Well, um, hack you, I guess. Not that it's gonna achieve much if I do this, but hey. Because everybody will go flying. Um. <laughs> that is uh, somewhat ridiculous. You're just stuck there, aren't you? <laughs> okay. That was, uh, interesting. Ryko 6 is a bit good pistol. Not better than the stiletto, though. We isolated four chemicals that we combined to counteract the toxins. They must be mixed in precise quantities as each chemical is poured. The equipment will mark the maximum, minimum and maximum amount that will work. Too little or too much will spoil the result. We already did that. But I guess I forgot to look at the notes first. Alright. We got out of there. Pretty good. They came out of there. You mean the get... the inorganics the Asari had with her? Venezia brought them with her. How can I get into the maintenance area? A team lead would have access. Like Dr. Cohen. He's in the medical bay. I'll be leaving now. Yeah. Oh yeah, because that's where we want to go, I think. And Dr. Cohen will help us after we return with... The cure. So we'll, we'll have to do that. I forgot it was uh, the Asari doctor that attacked you. I knew you got an ambush there, but I forgot by who. Where's Medical Bay? Over here. I think you can go through the restricted area, but again, that's not the way to go if you want to stay friends with everybody. Maybe that's what uh, gets them to attack you. I honestly don't remember. I just know it's possible. It did happen to me once, and I was trying to do things in a different order. And I was like, let's not do that in the Let's Play. Is that the cure? You did it? That a sorry scientist, the one in the mess hall? She just tried to kill us. Celestia? That's unbelievable. I... I, uh, I don't know much about her. She arrived a month ago. One of the shareholders pulled strings to get her here. Probably Saren. Let me guess. Saren the Spectre? Yes. I think that was the name. I, I don't pay attention to the other research teams. 
Look, the guards, they've been more on edge since you got here. I think they were expecting you. And there are more labs in the back. The guards won't even let me back there. Just people with clearance. What about the maintenance area? Do you have access to that? The maintenance area? Yes. Take my pass. But there's just snow back there. Let me see that file. An extension on Phelps' work? I thought he was on the right track. I can't thank you enough that... Oh, God, what a cliché. You saved their lives, do you know that? I don't really need Medigel, but whatever. Could you spare a few medical packs? They're worth their weight in gold up here. You didn't get these from me. Ventrolis wanted them saved for his people. I need to administer this. Thanks again. Okay, well, he, um... Got us into maintenance. And I don't think there's anything else to do here. So let's move on. Go back downstairs, which is this way, not the other way. I don't know if it's faster to run until you're exhausted and then wait, or to like do it in bursts, like weapon overheating works. Sure, somebody has timed it, but I have not. All right, get into the maintenance area. Pretty sure there's gonna be a Geff attack here or Brachni or something. Both, probably both. Nobody hit anything except me, but sure. I thought there were Geff here too, but guess I was wrong. Is this gonna lead to the boss fight? I don't know if it does. Curious to see what they did with that after the changes that we saw in the Um, equalizer 7, I'll take that. I don't really like rail extension because of the cooldown. H7 is not better. Despite the extra slot. After what they did to the Krogan uh, fight, I'm very curious to see what they did to Benezia's fight. I'm like saving every couple steps here. I feel like I'm playing a Sierra game. There she is. You do not know the privilege of being a mother. There is power in creation. To shape a life, turn it toward happiness or despair. Her children were to be ours. Raised to hunt and slay Saren's enemies. I won't be moved by sympathy, no matter who you bring into this confrontation. Liara's here because she wants to be, not because I asked her to. Indeed. What have you told her about me, Liara? What could I say, Mother? That you're insane? Evil? Should I explain how to kill you? What could I say? Have you faced an Asari commando unit before? Few humans have. Yeah, I think we'll be fine. I can't believe you'd kill your own daughter. I now realize I should have been stricter with her. You getting stasis on us?
these guys love to rush you and hit you with biotic powers that knock you down, which is exactly what's happening here. <laughs> I think Tali got knocked down. Oh, they have pretty good resistance. Or my lift actually didn't work at all. Oh, this is way bigger. Way more space to move around here. And Benezia is in a bubble, which makes it clearer that you can't attack her. What are you doing? still sucks. What's everybody doing for health? They're fine. Alright, Benezia can't really hit you from this side, so that's good. Would you like to attack your friends? That will never not be hilarious. basically missing all my shots. Not helpful. You're hidden back here somewhere. Hi! Alright. They got him as soon as he got out of cover. More Geth. Getting weaker, I guess, is what that's showing. Oh, now we've got people coming in from both sides. And we have Destroyer, we don't want that. Actually, let's do... Attacking him again. Are you stuck in your own shield thingies? You were, weren't you? Oh, I thought he was dead. Is not. Yeah, this fight is not as drastically easier as the um, Krogan Battlemaster fight was, but the new layout definitely makes it easier not to get stuck like in a bad spot where Benezia is just belting you with powers. And I got it. This is not over. Saren is unstoppable. My mind is filled with his light. Everything is clear. 
The Rachni didn't cooperate with you. Why should I? I will not betray him. You will. You... You must listen. Saren still whispers in my mind. I can fight his compulsions briefly, but the indoctrination is strong. Why are you able to break free of his control now? I sealed a part of my mind away from the indoctrination, saving it for a moment when I could help destroy him. It will not last long. So you could turn on me again? Yes, but it would not be my will, Shepard. People are not themselves around Saren. You come to idolize him, worship him. You would do anything for him. The key is Sovereign, his flagship. It is a dreadnought of incredible size, and its power is extraordinary. We know, of course, that that's actually Sovereign indoctrinating him, and that uh, of her, and that Saren himself is also indoctrinated. Sovereign's not like other ships. Where did it come from? I cannot say. The Geth did not build it. Its technology is far more advanced than that of any known species. The longer you stay aboard, the more Saren's will seems correct. You sit at his feet and smile as his words pour into you. It is subtle at first. I thought I was strong enough to resist. Instead, I became a willing tool, eager to serve. He sent me here to find the location of the Mew Relay. Its position was lost thousands of years ago. How does something that big go missing? 4,000 years ago, a star nearby went supernova. The shockwave propelled the relay out of its system, but did not damage it. Its precise vector and speed are impossible to determine. As millennia passed, the nebula created by the nova enveloped the relay. It is difficult to find any cold object in interstellar space, particularly something swathed in hot dust and radiation. Someone on Novaria found it? 2,000 years ago, the Rachni inhabited that region of our galaxy. They discovered the relay. The Rachni can share memories across generations. Queens inherit the knowledge of their mothers. Convenient. I took the location of the relay from the Queen's mind. I was not gentle. How did the Rachni find it? They searched, patiently. They are territorial creatures, driven to close any possible way into their systems. Why does Saren need the Mew Relay? He believes it will lead him to the Conduit. I would tell you more if I could, but Saren did not share his counsel with me. I was merely a servant to his cause. You can still make it right. Give me the information. I was not myself, but I should have been stronger. I transcribed the data to an OSD. Take it, please. Knowing the relay's coordinates is not enough. Do you know where he planned to go from there? Saren wouldn't tell me his destination. But you must find out quickly. I transmitted the coordinates to him before you arrived. You have to stop me. I, I can't. His teeth are at my ear. Fingers on my spine. You sh you should. Oh, you should. Mother, I don't leave. Fight him. You've always made me proud, Liara. Die. Think about it, it's kind of cruel to bring Liara here. She gets to kill her own mom. I'm stuck, I can't move. Oh, cause she... Oh, well that was easy. I cannot go on. You will have to stop him, Shepard. I think she's put me in stasis. But it didn't matter. Hold on. We've got Metagel. Maybe we can... No. He is still in my mind. I am not entirely myself. I never will be again. 
mother. Good night, little wing. I will see you again with the dawn. No light. They always said there would be a... Got another level up. What do I want? Nemesis. I'm gonna keep doing what I was doing. Lift singularity, nemesis, inspector training. Liara again, lift and singularity. Still don't have any extra charm points, so. I think you might need to pass a certain point on Paragon to get those. And Tali... Let's just do uh, armor for her. For now, let's go deal with the Ragnite Queen. This one serves as our voice. We cannot sing. Not in these low spaces. Your musics are colorless. Musics? What? Your way of communicating is strange, flat. It does not color the air. When we speak, one moves all. We are the mother. We sing for those left behind. The children you thought silenced. We are Rachni. How are you speaking through her? Our kind sing through touchings of thought. We pluck the strings and the other understands. She is weak to urging. She has colors we have no names for, but she is ending. Her music is bittersweet. It is beautiful. The children we birthed were stolen from us before they could learn to sing. They are lost to silence. End their suffering. They cannot be saved. They will only cause harm as they are. I don't understand. Why are your children killing people? These needlemen. They stole our eggs from us. They sought to turn our children into beasts of war. Claws with no songs of their own. Our elders are comfortable with silence. Children know only fear if no one sings to them. Fear has shattered their minds. I understand. A child left alone in a closet until she is 16 would not be sane. If you're sure they can't be saved. It is lamentable, but necessary. Do what you must. Before you deal with our children, we stand before you. What will you sing? Will you release us? Are we to fade away once more? Look, those tanks? Acid. Strong enough to kill anything, no matter its biology. They wouldn't have installed that if they weren't afraid of the consequences of her getting loose. They made a mistake. They let the Krogan go too far. This is a chance for us to atone. She has done nothing to us. Your 
Companions hear the truth. You have the power to free us, or return our people to the silence of memory. If I let you live, would you attack other races again? No. We... I... do not know what happened in the war. We only heard discordance, songs the color of oily shadows. We would seek a hidden place to teach our children harmony. If they understand, perhaps we would return. Um, yeah, I think it's, wasn't it the, the Reapers who, or Sovereign specifically, I guess, who tried to use the Arachni as his tool? We learn much, much later. Are you a survivor from the war? A clone? We do not know. We were only an egg, hearing Mother cry in our dreams. A tone from space hushed one voice after another. It forced the singers to resonate with its own sour yellow note. Then we awoke in this place, the last echo of those who came out from the singing planet. The sky is silent. So we get our big choice here that doesn't really end up mattering that much in the end. There's a trend here. Um, it definitely felt like a really big choice for playing this game the first time. But yeah, if you let... Uh, if you kill the Ragnite Queen here, the Reapers will just get a new one. Who's kind of insane, so the only real difference is I think that you can't reason with her in Mass Effect 3 and therefore can't get Rachni war assets. But that's just a number, not really that big of a change. Now if, you know, killing the the Ragni Queen meant not facing any Ravagers in Mass Effect 3, that would have... Uh, I think that's the name of the Ragni husk enemies that you face. That would be a, an incentive. Again, there's just too many decisions in Mass Effect where there's no real downsides to picking the Paragon option. It tends to just be, always be the best option in terms of outcome. I won't destroy your entire race. You'll go free. You will give us the chance to compose anew? We will remember. We will sing of your forgiveness to our children. Exactly how the Rachni gets off this planet, I don't know. It's not like it can hire a ship. Maybe as a stowaway. Alrighty. Uh, we didn't upgrade again. That is it for the Rachni Queen, but we are not quite done on Novaria. And we'll continue in the next video.